Well, I've got a bit of a quiz. Andy James Asylum, the running, jumping, standing still, the Valentines, In Focus, <laughs> Axiom, the Fat Pigs, Brew and the Blues. What do they all have in common? Well, I can tell you they are sharing the same drummer who's joining us right now, Doug Lavery. Doug, I'm sure there's plenty more that we could add to that list. <laughs> yeah, there's probably about 10 more here in Australia, and then over in America there's probably about 10 more. You've had a huge career. So why the drums? Basically, I bought some drums when my parents bought them for me when I was 16 years old when we lived out in Ashgrove. And then they decided to put blankets on them because every time I come home from school, I try to play them, but they had blankets all over them. That was the neighbour's <laughs> request? <laughs> I guess so, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you play any other instruments than the drums? play a little bit of guitar, you know, like, you know, rhythm and, of course, bass. And I tried my hand at keyboards, but that didn't work out. Vocals is another instrument. Yeah, yeah, I, I like to sing a bit. A few little projects going on at the moment. And the one that I'm looking at at the moment is the Rock and Blues. We have that out at Diagula on the fourth Sunday of every month between one and five. And Brew and the Blues are the hosts. So can you tell us all about what's going on out there at Diagula? Yeah, what happens every fourth um, you know, Sunday? Well, actually, it's going to be the last Sunday because I believe October or something's got five Sundays in it or whatever. <laughs> There's a couple of those, yes. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, no, pretty much uh, uh, Cricket, the owner of the Dag Pub, rang me and he said would you like to put on a, a blues afternoon a blues show i said sure why not so what i did is i put it together and and it's and it's not an open mic situation it's not a jam session but we book bands in there from one o'clock to five o'clock and it's going really well we've you know we've only held two of them you know start up again in september and there's a yeah. reason behind that because you're heading off overseas tomorrow yeah i'm, I'm leaving tomorrow and getting back on the second of september I'm going over there to plan a big party for my daughter. She's 21. She oh, turns 21 too, on August uh, August 19th. Yeah, and um, you know I'm kind of old fashioned, so I like to put on a pretty first birthday party. <laughs> Brew and the Blues. How long have they been together? I got this band together when I got back at the end of January. Uh, I've always wanted to put together a band that played some great old blues songs and some great old rock songs and play all festivals. You know, none of the clubs because it's a seven-piece band. So it's a if there's a lot of um, you know players and singers involved in it, mm. so we wouldn't really you know fit on a small stage. So we're just headed towards the festival stages. Well, if you do like your blues and your soul music, you can always tune here on Tuesday nights because we have uh, John Coney has two hours of blues and soul and he goes right across the tracks there. But if you want to go out and see some live blues, people get out to Diagula. It is the Rock and Blues. Brew and the Blues are putting it on the last Sunday of every month between 1 and 5 p.m. If you just hop onto Doug Lavery onto his Facebook page, he will have all the information there because I think the website's still in building, isn't it? It won't be done until I get back in September. Ah, well, look, have a great trip while you're away, Doug. I do want to catch up after you get back, find out what's going on and what's going to be happening, say, in the next 12 months. Your history, too, that I think a lot of our listeners would like to hear a little bit more about, um, I'm sure, and some of the outfits that we've seen in some photos that if you have a little bit of a dig around, it's quite interesting. You have a lovely, colourful past. Yeah, I'd like to invite you and, and, and the Big D up to the Mitchell Creek Rock and Blues Fest there on uh, the 15th of September. But, you know, we're playing there on a Saturday, and it's just a wonderful festival. Well, we just might it have... Well, it's a date. How's that? Yeah, yeah, you're definitely going to check it out, Tracy. It's no a worries. great little festival. <laughs> Thanks, Doug. Well, here is... We're going to play his music right now. It is Brew on the Blues and Once in a While. Thanks, Tracy. Living life, the best.